Hey everyone, it's Christina and I am just hopping on here real quick to do a little like cooking tutorial of some cupcakes that I'm about to make. Now I have never made these and they're all from scratch and this is like the second time I think like yeah like second time that I've made cupcakes from scratch the first time they didn't turn out so good. Um, so oh god what is that? Do you see that? Oh, whew, it's on the lens. <laughs> okay, so um, they are pink lemonade cupcakes with pink lemonade buttercream frosting, and they sound super yummy. And I thought it would be really good for the summertime. In here, it's been like 93 to 95 the past few days, and it's supposed to be that all week long. And I was going to make um brownie cookies with salted caramel cream and I still am going to make those but I thought this sounded better so um, let's get started I just want to show you the ingredients first so this is everything that you're going to need you need pink lemonade concentrate buttermilk egg whites flour powdered sugar baking soda, baking powder, food coloring, which you cannot find the drops anywhere, so I had to get gel food coloring, and then unsalted butter, and then your mixer. So, um, I was a little shocked that I could not find the, like, liquid drops of, um, food coloring. I mean, I thought they still made that stuff, but apparently not. Um, so I'm going to get everything measured out and I'll be back. Okay, so I forgot to show two ingredients, um, vegetable oil and sugar. You definitely need those. Um, so, um, you just combine flour, baking powder, baking soda, and salt in a bowl and you set it aside. Then you um, whisk together your sugar, oil, egg whites, and lemonade concentrate which I have that all right here. So just put it down and put it on low. And that's just gonna whisk everything together. Okay. So while that is going, sorry I have my fan on. Um, you let that mix together and then you add in buttermilk and then your flour mixture. So, we'll do that and just mix up your flour mixture and then add a little bit of it in. And you want to add this in in three different parts and then you add your buttermilk in in two different parts. A quarter cup. I'm going to just have to use half of a cup and just do half of it. Then just add half of this in. And then add in more of your flour. going to change attachment okay so I went ahead and changed to the paddle attachment with the rubber spatula on the side um, what I should have done was whisk together my first ingredients and then when I started adding 
the um, flour, I should have changed it. So, I, it should just scrape the sides. Yeah. Okay, so anyways, um, that just needs to go until smooth, and then we need to add some food coloring. And like I said before, you cannot find the, um, like the tubes of the liquid. So, I just had, had to get the gel, and let's see. Okay, so I just added some food coloring. And I don't know if this is going to pick up. Yeah, you can kind of see. There we go. So it's turning a nice pink color. And that's what we want. Okay, so the batter is all done. And it's a real nice pink color. So you're just going to move your batter into your liners. And like I said, this makes nine cupcakes. So Okay, so I got all my liners filled. As you can see, um, okay, sorry about the lighting. Um, as you can see, I kind of spilled some here, so you want to make sure you clean that up um, before you put it in the oven. And I got two little tiny ones, the little overpouring on a few. But, anyways, um, you just want to put those in the oven at um, 350 degrees for. I believe it's like 20 minutes. So I'm going to get those in and get started on the icing. Okay, so for your lemonade buttercream icing, you need um, three cups and three tablespoons of your powdered sugar, your butter, your salt, your concentrate, and food coloring. So it's really easy to make. Um, so basically you just throw all the ingredients in your mixer and then um, you turn it on. So. Okay, so I have everything ready for the um, icing, and there it is. And with this, you'll use the paddle attachment and just lock it. Okay, and then, oh, geez. Again, this is the first time I've used this, and powdered sugar is coming out. So anyways, this should um, turn into a nice creamy frosting. And the cupcakes are done. And this is what they look like. Uh, the little one did get a little more brown, but they smell so good. Jay even came out here and said they were making them hungry, so that's a good sign. Okay, so the icing's been on for about two minutes. And as you can see, it's getting nice and fluffy. So, it shouldn't be too long and we should have some yummy cupcakes. Um, those have to cool and then I can ice them. So, um, these are the finished cupcakes. As you can see there's one missing um, while we were waiting on them to cool. We tried the little one and I must say they're pretty darn good. Um, it's not an overwhelming um, lemonade taste. but. They are pretty good. Um, they turned out really good, so you should try it. Um, I will link the recipe below. I found it on Pinterest. Um, imagine that. So, anyways, I hope you all have a great 4th of July, and I will talk to you later. Bye. Okay, so one more thing. After eating one, the icing is very creamy. It just didn't, when I was putting it on with the spoon, it just felt like it, um... I got a little hard, but it did it. It was really yummy, and I am definitely making these again. So, okay, goodbye.